How is it going, ladies and gentlemen? My name is Jay Groff, and welcome to Grand River Gaming. Today, I have another Pokemon Showdown battle for you today, and today I am using a team with a Mega Pokemon this time, and um, Lucario is actually one of my favorite Pokemon. I think he's sweet. Um, ever since Gen 4, I like to have Lucario in my party, just because um, Steel Fighting Typing is sweet. Um, with the introduction of Lucario Knight, um, Lucario actually gets a great special attack stat. Uh, Mega Lucario, I'm sorry, gets a great special attack stat. So I'm usually using a special attacking Mega Lucario, which I'm not sure if it is um, common or not, but I just like to use uh, special attacking Lucario. Um, so let's play this battle. I'm on this side, by the way, and uh, let's start. So he, I thought he was going to start out with Ferrothorn, but he goes into Rotom Wash. I switch out because I don't want to take a Hydro Pump that quickly. Uh, Greninja comes in, and I knew he was going to Hydro Pump, so resist it. I throw out uh, a Grass Knot, uh, and I thought it was going to do a lot more because uh, Roan Wash's only effective thing is a Grass uh, type move. I'm just stumbling around here, sorry. He goes for the Volt Switch. I was a Grass Pokemon, so I resist it quite nicely. He switches into Mega Kangaskhong, which is scary, um, and I knew my Roan Wash could take basically any hit from him. Even though he is specially defensive, I just know he couldn't really do much. Uh, so he goes for the Power Up Punch. Power Up Punch plus um, Parental Band. Bond is a very scary combination, so I had to get the Burned off if I wanted to survive. Thankfully, I did get the will o -Wisp off. So he goes for another Power-Up Punch, and he is getting jacked. Um, luckily, I think I get a Pain Split off, so that um, heals me a bit so I could take another hit or two. And um, So he goes for the Return, takes me out. I knew it was going to obliterate me, but I didn't really want to sack a Pokemon. So I guess Rotom was a good Pokemon to keep in there. My Mamas one is Scarfed, so I knew he was going to take something. So he goes for the Sucker Punch. I go for the Earthquake. Take out the Mega Kangaskhan. There's a huge threat out of the table. Uh, here comes Ferrothorn. I take this opportunity to take the Stealth Rocks out, and he lead sheets me. I knew I was going to go down. I kind of want to save my Mamas one. Uh, it comes in handy at the end. Here I come Lucario, and um, now he switches, if I'm not mistaken. So I Mega Evolve. He protects. I take this opportunity to go Nasty Plot, because I knew this Ferrothorn wasn't going to do anything to my Lucario. Aura Sphere takes him out one hit, because he's obviously a defensive Ferrothorn, which is great. So I'm in plus two right now. Um, now I go for Dark Pulse on my Rotom. And I thought I was going to kill it, but I guess not. It was just a minimal damage type thing. He goes for the burn on my Lucario. Thank God um, he's not actually an attack in Lucario. He's a special attacking, so he doesn't get the attack drop. So he's still full special attack. This was a bad play on me. I thought I was going to be faster than him because usually guard chomps are quite slow. So my Lucario goes down, unfortunately. I throw out a quick ice shard and almost kill the guard chomp, which I'm pretty happy about. Mamo's wine did come in handy in this fight, which I'm very happy about. Escadrill, great Pokemon. I love him. I take this opportunity to go for Sword Stance because I knew he was going to Earthquake. And not a lot of people know about the air balloon for some reason. So I rapid spin my spikes away because I still have Talonflame out just in case. I take this opportunity to go for the storage dance. And then he, uh, Clefable Calm Mines. So I know I'm faster than Clefable now. I just go for the Earthquake. Knock him right out. Um, right next he has the Aegislash. Aegislash, scary Pokemon. I take another opportunity to go for uh, Sword Dance because I knew he was going to King Shield. That's um, a predictable play for an Aegislash. So I go for a Sword Dance yet again. I forget why. That was a risky play if he had a fighting move. I would have gotten knocked out. I think I accidentally misclicked or something. I didn't know if he had the Air Balloon or not, but I think he didn't because he had the leftovers. Um, anyways, I just go for the Shadow Claw because it's super effective anyways and a high critical hit chance. At a plus four, and he wasn't even defensive typing, it was going to take it out anyways. Extra Drill is a very strong Pokemon. So there you are, guys. I really hope you enjoyed this fight. I had a good time. I am actually playing because Mega Lucario is banned in Smogan OU. I have to play Ubers, so I'm getting a lot of Pokemon uh, battles where they're using just like all the legendaries and the Ubers and stuff. So maybe I'm going to upload one that I just absolutely decimate all the god Pokemons. So we'll see what happens like that. Once again, I've been Jay Groff. Thanks for watching Grand River Gaming. I'll see you guys later. Bye.